There we go. All right. Finally, on the Bandit 200. Spotted bass. Oh, and he fell off. That's four. Zero for four, guys. Good God. <sighs> Looks like a big bluegill on the Bandit. Yeah, no oh, sunfish on the band. Look at that. that's a hybrid, isn't it? It looks different. That's a big sunfish. Look at that. Yeah. It look it don't look right. It looks like a bluegill hybrid. I don't know if they hybridize though. It's got red eyes too. Well, I don't know. That and it, its pattern just don't look exactly like a hundred percent long ear. It looks like a mix between a bluegill and a long ear. I'm gonna have to ask Tyler if that's possible. And its belly even looks like a bluegill kind of. They're biting like crazy. I'm telling you, I've missed five fish out of six. All right, guys, nice little sunfish here that I'm kind of questioning about because it has the designs and patterns of a bluegill mix, especially the belly and parts. It's just the shape of it and everything. So I don't know. Weird little long ear. It just ain't as colorful as it should be either. But finally, first fish. They're biting like crazy, I'm telling you. As soon as I got here, my crankbait hit the water and I let it rest for like five seconds like that and a fish came up and attacked it. That was the first one that got off, the mystery. So top waters would have worked. I should have brought my buzz bait. Got him. Crappie on the bandit. Told you it's the best day. Oh, man. All right, guys, white crappie. Guys. It was the best fishing day, plus this front came in. It said 70% rain, and we took a... Why is he bleeding so bad? I didn't even hook him there. Yeah, my hook's barely in. What? His gills are messed up. Look at that, it's hanging out. He's, gonna, he's not going to make it. His gills hanging out. It ain't for me. Weird. Because my hooks are barely in. Look, I got them off without pliers. His gill is hanging out right here. He's not going to live. You want to keep? All right, guys. Nice little white crappie. On the Bandit 200, Metal Flake again. Oh yeah. Oh, he got off. Damn it. Oh, got him again. Oh. This fish got off after two or three second battle and came back after it 20 feet away from where he originally hit it, guys. Nice little spotted bass. Still using that Bandit 200. Never lets me down. 
very seldom lets me down guys especially the metal flake and chart flake this is the metal flake what an amazing crankbait about a pound spotted bass pretty decent they are just biting like crazy guys declining weather is the answer always is right when the weather starts to decline <sighs> never preach that enough what'd you get is that a bass what is it a crappie is it the black nose oh my god wilma got a gigantic crappie guys I told they are biting like crazy. I just caught one down there as soon as I got there. What is it? Is it a black nose? Oh my God. God. That's the biggest, one of the biggest crappies I've ever seen come out of a river, guys. Hold it up the other way. It's dang close to one of the biggest crappie I've ever seen come out of a river at all. That's two of these she's gotten out of here. Too bad it ain't that magnolia we put back because we really wanted to mount it. Oh my gosh, hold it down. <laughs> oh, I cannot believe that. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe I get this big one. Okay, let's, Ooh. let me measure it. I'm gonna say it's only 13. It could be 14 though. Give it a minute, let me check. I'm, I'll do it. Just hold it. Just hold the fish. I got it. Get from here and to this mouth. He's 13. From here. 13. 13, 13 even. Yep. Yeah. 13. Still, that's a nice. It's over that's a nice river crappie, though. That is a giant. Oh my God. This place always never lets us down guys we always get something here every time we come we don't sit here and catch 50 fish because we're just in one hole but it always produces something my reel got completely drenched in the water it can't be good for it oh my god 13 inch crappie again. Your black nose was 14 though, wasn't it? There he is. Oh yeah. All right, another bass. Another bass. Honey, caught two bass already. Both spotted. You got one? Now Wilma's reeling in something. My God, guys, it's... Oh, no. I thought you had one too. All right, now they're spotted. Oh, yeah. Got another one. Crappie. All right. Crappie. Man. Now I caught a crappie again on the crankbait. I'm not switching my lure. They're hitting everything. They're really aggressive. Another white crappie. Mine's only about eight inches <laughs> all right guys white crappie for me that's crappie number two for me wow Number 
second crappie of the day. We have caught four all together, two, two a person and they've all four been whites. <sighs> Pretty sure my first one was. I can't really remember now. It might have been black my first one. God. Yeah, these rocks are dangerous. Guys, we're really on these fish for a short trip like this. Man. Just hold it like that for a few seconds. All right, good job. God. Oh, oh, that was a rarity down here. That was a small mouth. Very rare down here. Because <sighs> they are way out of their zone. Just a few scragglers down here. Get real patient over there, right by that stick. Yes, crappie. Oh, it's big. Oh my. Oh my. Oh. Oh goodness. Oh my goodness. Don't fall off. Oh my god. Black nose. It's it. It's the fish. We got the fish again, guys. Oh, we got it. We got the magnolia. This is not the blackness of magnolia. Oh. <laughs> guys. We regret not mounting this fish because this is a rare magnolia crappie. She caught this back in what, April? Yeah, big first week of April. No, wait a minute. It looks black. That's a black nose. Yeah. Oh my god, it's black not nose. the magnolia, it's is not it? Like that I catch. Uh uh. That is still. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, look at this black nose. No, it is. That one? That's not a black crappie design. It, it is in a yeah, way. It looks like because it's got big. I think that might be him. I don't know. Because it has the stripes right here. Faint, sure really faint. He I was 14. 14. Oh my gosh, guys. I caught the same fish she caught back in April. <laughs> it was 14 even. Wasn't it? Wait a this may be a different one. 13. 13, it's yeah. a different fish. Different fish. That is a magnolia though. Where are these coming from? That's not a black nose because it ain't regular dots. See how they're irregular? Mm -hmm. Two times. Okay, I want you to film me really good just for a minute. Oh my God, thank you, missile. All right, the missile swim bait. <laughs> what? All right, what guys, doing? magnolia crappie. See the racing stripe? Now, a black nose would have the design, complete design of a black crappie on the side. If you'll pay attention to this, this is more of a hybrid. It's a mix between a black and white because it kind of has faint vertical bars going down and the black dots or specks that are on a black crappie are irregular as opposed to perfectly separated. These are kind of in bars. This is a magnolia crappie. They're sterile, lab made, lab created, are not stocked anywhere in the whole state of Missouri, guys. But somehow we've caught two of them now. Of course, we are 10 minutes from the Arkansas state line and they are stocked in Arkansas, but this tells you that crappie migrate that far. That is so crazy. Oh my gosh, we each got one now. So you want to mount it? Uh, not 13. Not a little 13 inch. Oh my 13. gosh. Okay. Feel me better. For, I want to make sure we got good. Yeah. Like real close up and then kind of far away too.
Guys, I'll probably never get one of these ever again. We don't know where they're coming from. It's the only explanation. I actually contacted the Department of Conservation over this, and he said, we don't put them anywhere in Missouri, is all he told me. He goes, they had to come out of the White River, which is about 50, 60, 70 miles away, up the Black River, out of the White, and then up the Current River, and then up the Little Black. This is just, it just baffles me. It really does. But this is definitely a magnolia. If he was one inch bigger, I would mount it, but he's only 13. I don't want to mount a fish that little. Oh my God. Isn't that weird? Two of them. Where are they coming from? Why would they migrate all the way up here? Then why ain't they in Cane Creek then or Black River? Unless we've caught them before and thought they were black nose the whole time. My gosh, guys. That is without a doubt the coolest fish I've caught all year. We thought it was the same fish exactly as Wilma's and we was just talking about if we catch this again, we're keeping it and mounting it because she caught the 14 inch magnolia. But it only measured 13. I really doubt it shrank a whole inch in a month and a half. There's a truck here. God, that is so awesome. My God, it's so tempting. If he was one more inch, I would. I don't want to mount a little 13 inch fish though. God, how are they getting so big in this little creek? You don't catch crappie this big in a little creek like this. I can jump across it in certain spots. How small it is up there. My goodness, guys. I'm going to get her back in. Oh, my gosh. What a day. I hope she's all right. Yeah, she'll be fine. There she went. <laughs> I see her. That's a big fish. She's swimming really weird, though. A lot of fish jumping too. Oh man, what do I got? Whoa, whoa. It's gotta be a bow fin. Or, oh man, I only got four pound line. Oh man. It could be a big cat. I just told you I had a catfish. It is, it's a gigantic gigantic bullhead oh my no it's a flathead oh my god oh, guys i'm battling a flathead with four pound line i gotta take my time i gotta lighten this drag i cannot risk this oh my god we need the dip net that is a beautiful flathead oh my god I'm just going to let him wear down. I'm making sure he putters completely out. Yeah, it's good other things. Well, that's okay. I told you I had something weird. I said it's either a turtle or a bullhead. Sure enough, it was a flathead, guys. Talk about patience paying off sitting in one spot. This is twice out of this river this has happened. Her last year, she caught a nice seven pounder. Lucky. Now I got a flathead. Ow. I thought it was a giant bullhead because I seen it for a split second. I, then I was like, eh, they don't get that big. I mean, they do, but not in here. But I don't know how good he's hooked either. I have never battled a flathead with four pound line, guys. Talk about risky. I'm just letting him putter out though. He's just a little two pounder, but I'm really happy just to get one. That is so cool. God, we got everything today. And then tomorrow's the opposite, poor. I've been wanting one of these all year. That's why I want to go with the block hole this weekend for fish for these. I don't care if they're this size. I'm happy with this size. I don't care about the size much as long as they're two and three pounders. Okay, I need you. 
I need you to hold my pole and then I'm gonna grab it. Okay. Just don't do anything if it just don't do anything. I gotta make sure I step on rocks that don't. No, it's not. There, none of them are. I don't trust any of these rocks. He's not done. Oh man. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it is. Hope. Oh. I'm trying. We got him. Yes. God. That ain't as bad as I thought it was. He's bigger than I thought. Talk about perfect eating size right here. Now I need you to film me, so quit doing what you're doing for a minute. I'm gonna put this one first. No. I want you to film me. That is so awesome. Look at his head. <laughs> Look how pretty it is. That's a, a male. Yeah. I've never seen one with a head that flat. It looks like someone beat it with a hammer. My goodness, guys. That is so cool. I don't get many of these a year. I'm lucky to get two or three a year. And I've been wanting one. He's a little guy, but he's about two pounds. It's a nice little pretty male flathead, real dark. With the blotches all over him. I am so glad we came now. I got two awesome fish in one day. Two rarities, I should say. Just take it off my head. Make sure it's filming. And then make sure it's straight. We don't want to miss this. Is it on? It's on. All right, guys. I got him on a red wiggler. Four pound line. If that line would have, if this fish would have been much bigger, I would never had a chance with four pound line. You talk about a flat head. His head is completely flat. It looks like someone hit him with a hammer. <laughs> um. Trying to hide my hands. Good view. Mm -hmm. You should do it like that. You can sew the flat. Like that. There we go. They were biting that good today, guys. Anything was biting. This was about the time you caught yours last year, too, though. Same mm -hmm. about same week. Okay. I can go back and look. All right, guys, we're going to get her back in. Boy, that'd be a good meal right there for one person. That's the size you actually want them at. I'm just trying to get different views, different angles. Nice fish, guys. Look at that black. All right. Wow. Gosh. Hey, no, 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 no. Don't throw it away. Hey, come here. Go, do, go down, not splash it. I can't believe the fish we ended up catching. having trouble seeing as of now. What a beautiful sunset. Good thumbnail right there for the video, right there.
until next time guys hit that like button and please subscribe